Assassin Nation girl is back with another motherfucking video. Period. Cool. Okay. Now this type of video is something that you know I don't really like talking about. And again, y'all know they. Yeah, poo poo. I got Lily in here with me, y'all. So excuse me. But y'all know they say don't expose. You know anything you going through or don't expose your insecurities because you know people can use that you know against you but i'm at the stage in my life where i don't care nobody's perfect for one everyone has something that they want to change you know to make them themselves feel more confident i have insecurities i'm about to share my insecurities with you guys i want this to be a message to let you know not just females but males too because males can have insecurities as well because again no one's perfect it's okay to you know address those insecurities me personally i'm addressing mine because you know one i don't care and two i know what can people say about me you know that i don't already know it's not gonna hurt me before i start this video give you a thumbs up um comment subscribe turn on post notifications so you won't miss no uploads from me and we're gonna get started with this video so hold on y'all I have a few insecurities okay the very first one is my gap before I had braces um, ever before I got in braces I had a gap y'all and I was like so insecure about it I used to get talked about in middle school because of my gap when I officially got braces I was so happy you know but I wasn't that happy because as soon as I got the braces I wanted my gap to close instantly but it didn't so it was like the braces and my gap was still showing so i still wasn't happy with myself over time my gap started closing and you know i was getting a little more happy and that insecurity you know was you know fixed you know what i'm saying i ain't had my gap you know so i was good I'm pretty sure some of y'all noticed my gap has come back not entirely but my gap had you know reopened um due to me being irresponsible I put my retainers inside of my paper towel because I was about to, I was getting ready to eat my pizza. Um, I put my retainers in my paper towel, you know, because I didn't want to just sit it down, you know, on my bed or anywhere. So I just kindly, you know, put it inside um, the paper towel. My retainers are clear, so it's very easy, easy to lose, you know what I'm saying? I should have put them in my retainer case, um, but, you know, I didn't. So I ended up forgetting about them. I ended up throwing them away. You know, I supposed to go to Michigan um, to get my retainers. So, you know, um, I'm not really, you know, mad. Because, um, you know, I'm getting them. You know what I'm saying? It would have been a different story if, you know, I c couldn't get them. And yes, I am paying out of pocket for them. They're not cheap. Um, but it's something I have to because I want to, because I don't want my gap to get any bigger because my gap was like really big, y'all. So I don't want it to get any bigger because, you know, that that was an insecurity that, you know, I um, <clears throat> had. Second insecurity is my boobs. My boobs are like, people say they're not that big, you know what I'm saying? Because I've seen bigger boobs, but they're, you know, not how I want them to be. and um you know it didn't make it no better since i had lele now they're like mom boobs like they're saggy you know what i'm saying so i'm insecure about that i do want to you know get my boobs done um i actually want to get a bbl you know call me retarded or stupid but i would want to get a bbl because you know i still have fat from being pregnant I still have stretch marks that I will show you guys. Um, and I know they say workout, you know, and I tried that, you know, but honestly, I'm lazy. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to working out to get the body that I want, you know what I'm saying? I'm lazy at that. Whenever I do get, you know, the BBL done, of course, I'm going to work out. And of course, I'm going to be right. I just feel like the BBL will be a start for me. That's what I'm The BBL will be a, a, a major start for me, you know what I'm saying? Because I will have the body that I want. And then I'll be working out and eating right. I'm also insecure about my body. You know, I don't have the hips that I want. You see, I don't have the hips that I want. Um, my butt. You know, I lost my butt a little bit. Um, so I don't have the body that I want. Um, you can see the stretch marks. Let me see. 
I have like little stretch marks right here. You can see it. Um, I have stretch marks on my stomach. Um, I still have fat. Like, it's just, I'm not talking about getting a big butt. You know what I'm saying? Like a Nicki Minaj, but I ain't talking about that. But just like a butt lift, some hips, you know, um, a breast reduction. You know what I'm saying? Um, I know a lot of people are going to be like, you don't need that. Just work out. But sometimes working out don't get you the body that you want. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's the healthier way, you know what I'm saying? And working out, that's the healthier way. But, I mean, I just feel like this. There's nothing wrong with getting, getting things done to your body. You know what I'm saying? If that's what's going to make you happy. Somebody can tell you that you look beautiful. But if you don't feel it in your heart, it's not going to matter. And that's me. Tate tells me that I'm beautiful every day. But, you know, I say thank you, you know what I'm saying? But deep down, I just don't feel that I'm beautiful, you know what I'm saying? Um, so people can tell me I'm beautiful throughout the day, you know what I'm saying? But if I don't feel it in my heart, it just doesn't matter to me. And that's just how I am. Um, me having these insecurities, you know what I'm saying, definitely gets in the way of me and Tay's relationship. I put myself down a lot and it's not good. You know, I have a daughter and I'm trying to get better, you know, for my daughter, cause I don't want my daughter having insecurity issues or feeling like she's not beautiful and stuff like that. I'm gonna miss it. <laughs> That's why um, I hope that my baby girl, you know, doesn't, you know, have insecurities. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if she do, you know, of course I'm gonna tell her, you know, you're not the only one your mommy had insecurities, you know. You gonna let mommy finish the video? Hmm? You gonna let mommy finish the video? Do -do. Um, so what else? That was really it. It was just my gap that I was insecure um that I'm insecure about in my body, you know. Um I was very stressed out, I lost a lot of weight. I was very stressed out. Um, because you know, I just my body changed, you know, since I had to like, you know, my body changed, so I was very stressed out. It was times where I would go on my Instagram and, you know, I would cry a little bit because, you know, I be seeing these Instagram models looking how I want to look, you know what I'm saying? Um, so I'd be like, dang, why can't my boobs be like that? Why gotta be saggy? Why can't my butt be like that? You know what I'm saying? I put myself down a lot and again, it's not good. I'm still working on it. I'm not a shame to address you know my insecurities i feel as though you know nobody else should there's a ton of things that i love about myself that outweighs you know on um, my insecurities but one thing that i know for sure is that i've gotten more comfortable with addressing my insecurities um i am you know still working on those insecurities i gotten much better now than how i was i'm dealing with them better now yeah, all i know is that you know no one can talk about me because you know i'm pretty sure it's something deep down that they're insecure about that they wish that they could change as well okay y'all so that wraps up you know this video um i wouldn't say your part two because you know there won't be no need of me giving a part two i'm not sure i mean if y'all want a part two spam it up i mean i don't know what i talk about because i addressed everything in this video but spam in the comments if you have insecurities how you deal with them you know what i'm saying is there anything that you would change um, is, there, is there anything that you wouldn't change? You know what I'm saying? Um, sum it up in the comments. Give this video a big thumbs up. Give this video a thousand likes, okay? Turn on post notifications. I'll be, I'll start to do like post notification shout outs, I guess, on my uh, channel. And also subscribe to me and my daughter's um, YouTube channel. The link will be in the description box below as well. We'll be dropping our first video once we reach 20 thousand subscribers, okay? So 20 thousand subscribers and we'll drop our very first video okay so with that being said just make sure i love you guys and i will see y'all in the next freaking video